But how is a new skill learned? That was a question which began to fascinate Thorndyke. To answer it, he built some ingenious puzzle boxes from which cats could only escape by operating latches. And in you go. The cat appears to be very clever in engineering its escape, solving the problem with a deftly placed paw and a push of its nose. But Thorndyke didn't believe that an animal, even a clever cat, understands the consequences of its behaviour. When he placed a cat in the puzzle box for the first time, Thorndyke was unable to see any evidence of flashes of insight. The successful actions appeared first by chance. He proved that the apparent cleverness arose by trial and error, and used graphs to measure the rate of learning. A well-practiced cat quickly recalls the actions that help it escape to its reward of food. If an action brings a reward, Thorndike believed that that action becomes stamped into the mind. In his thesis, he explained further his ideas about learning, that behaviour changes because of its consequences. He called this his law of effect, which explained how even wild creatures develop new habits. The two uh, pigeons are at either end of a small ping-pong table. One pigeon uh, pecks the ball as it comes toward him and knocks it toward the other pigeon. The other pigeon pecks the ball back across the table. If it goes past one pigeon, the other pigeon can eat, and if it goes the other way, the other pigeon eats. So that there is a real, it's a real game. The uh, pigeon uh, is reinforced for a cross-court shot if that is what gets the ball past his opponent. 